Two months earlier, it was officially announced that Nikon had acquired the US-based cinema company RED. This deal opened up endless possibilities for Nikon. It was clear that they were aiming to improve their video segment with this agreement. Just a few days after the announcement, rumors about a new Komodo camera with Nikon Z mount are beginning to show up. In today's video, we will analyze those speculations and discuss what Nikon can offer with this groundbreaking acquisition. We'll explore the potential for a Nikon Komodo Z, combining red cinematic power with Nikon's imaging expertise. So, let's get into the video. Brief History In early 2024, Nikon made waves in the camera industry by acquiring RED, a renowned US-based cinema company, for a surprisingly low $85 million. This move was sparked by a lawsuit RED had filed against Nikon, alleging patent infringement on compressed RAW technology. During the legal proceedings, Nikon recognized an opportunity to enter the professional digital cinema market. Nikon saw the possibility of combining their expertise in product development, reliability, and image processing with RED cinema camera knowledge and unique image compression technology. Nikon has hinted at developing cinema lenses and potentially introducing Z-mount to RED cameras, marking a significant shift in their approach to videography. Very recently, Nikon's president confirmed that the company will now focus more on videography, utilizing RED's existing strengths in this sector. All these news and announcements hint at a new Nikon Z Mount Komodo camera. Possible Specs There's still not much information available about the Komodo Z as it is still in its very initial phase. The last RED camera Komodo X included a 20-megapixel global shutter CMOS sensor, which provided advanced video capabilities. Now that, Nikon owns RED, the speculated camera will also use the same, if not a better sensor. We will most probably see a global shutter with improved video quality. It is rumored to have new RED video recording formats along with Nikon cinema lenses for Z-mount with T-stops. Features and Performance Although it is very early to determine anything about the Nikon Komodo Z, we can still take shots from the previous cameras. The latest camera by RED, the Komodo X can shoot excellent 6K videos at 80fps and 4K videos at 120fps in 12-bit RAW. So, there is a strong possibility that we can shoot 8K videos using the Komodo Z. Recently, RED has enabled a face detection autofocus system which works very well. The rumored Komodo Z will likely have more improved autofocus. But instead of the Canon's RF mount, we can expect the new camera to come with the most anticipated Z-mount. It is speculated to have enhanced 12-bit internal video recording capabilities. Is it really happening? The Nikon Komodo Z is still in a very early stage to talk about. Nikon hinted that we should not expect the camera to be announced anytime soon. Despite the excitement following Nikon's acquisition of RED, both companies have made it clear that significant changes are not imminent. Nikon's recent Facebook post confirms that RED's current product lineup, partnerships, and dealer relationships will remain unchanged for now. This suggests that AZ Mount RED Komodo is not in the immediate future. Nikon has emphasized continuity in RED's policies, including warranty, repair service, and customer support. While many speculated about quick developments like Z-mount RED cameras, both companies are taking a measured approach. It seems that any major changes or new products resulting from this acquisition will take time to materialize. For now, we can only rely on rumors and whispers about the uncertain Komodo Z. Final Thoughts While the Nikon Komodo Z remains very speculative at this point, the acquisition of RED by Nikon undoubtedly opens up exciting possibilities for the future of digital cinema and photography. The merging of Nikon's imaging expertise with RED's cinematic technology could potentially lead to groundbreaking products in the coming years. However, it is clear that significant changes won't happen overnight. 
We have to wait as Nikon and RED work to integrate their technologies and strategies. As the industry watches closely, we can expect gradual developments that may reshape the landscape of professional videography. The Nikon Komodo Z, if it sees the light, could be a game changer, but only time will tell how this acquisition will truly impact the world of cameras. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, do share this video and subscribe to our channel for more content like this.